Oh no. Oh no. I will break you and your smile. No! <laughs> Karens. They seem to be everywhere. And normal people, like you and me, are wondering how people are like this. What could drive women so crazy that they have to have public freakouts? Maybe they're just misunderstood. Well, today we're gonna find out. Because today, we need to harness all the Karen energy we can to become the ultimate Karen in Karen and Outrage Simulator. This is gonna be great for me because I never complain publicly about anything, even if I have the right to. So I can't even imagine having a public freak out outrage moment. Now is my time to shine. I mean, seriously, just look at my shirt today. It says chill out. I'm a chill person. Karens are not chill, so I have to not be me for the duration of this video. Ah uh, yes, what another beautiful day to ruin everybody else's day. It was a normal Tuesday morning like any other. The birds were chirping and the sun was shining. Karen was cleaning out her purse and found something. It was a coupon, good for 50% off a bag of big crisp chips. There was only one problem. It had expired on Monday, oh no. Well, don't worry, cause I am Karen and Karen can get anything she wants. Rules and dates don't mean anything to me. Hello, welcome to Con Mart. How can I help you today? Oh God, I look lovely. Very chill, friendly individual. Um, hi, I have this coupon I'd like to redeem. It says I can get a bag of chips for half price. Sure, let me have a look at that. Is there a problem? Oh, well, it expired yesterday. <laughs> he looks so smug, he's just like, mm hmm I'm sorry, but I can't accept this. These meters represent the cashier's result. Oh my God, so we have to break his confidence, his indifference, and his patience. Oh no, but I have a freak out meter. If your freak out meter fills up, you'll lose your cool and go crazy. There are always people with cameras around ready to capture the scene. You wouldn't want to become a bad meme, would you? Maybe I, maybe I want to be one. What do you mean you can't accept the coupon? Ooh, ooh, what do we want to break first? His confidence? His patience. Um, did you read it right? Are you sure that you got the date? Yes, I just double checked it. It expired at midnight yesterday. My apologies. Oh, don't give me that. Oh, I'm getting so angry. This is terrible customer service. You're not doing your job right. This is terrible customer service. Oh, is it? I'm sorry to disappoint. I empathize with your situation, but my hands are tied. No, I don't think they are. What would your boss do? You think they'd want to turn away a good sale? All right, just take the chip. Yes! I got my way! Yeah, victory music! I don't want any trouble. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I'll pay the dollar 40 myself if my boss gives me trouble. Yeah, that's right. Just please, let's finish this transaction and move on. Yeah, I knew you'd see sense eventually. Here's the money, you can keep the receipt. I'll just take my chips and leave. Yes! Oh no, I'm angry, what happened? Ugh, they only have sour cream flavor. But sour cream flavor is delicious. Oh, look at the guy in the window. He's like, oh God, I hate my life. Yeah, another win for the Karen. All right, where to next? Gotta get my coffee. After her victory at the con market, Karen was in the mood for celebration. She set out for her favorite coffee shop, the local Star Cups. On the way, she placed her order using her handy mobile app. All that she wanted was a simple drink. It's probably really difficult, isn't it? A grande macchiato with almond milk, six pumps of syrup, java chips, six pumps of espresso, fresh non-dairy whipped cream, and double vegan fair trade chocolate sauce at exactly 95 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh God, I hate her so much. <laughs> this guy looks so happy to be alive and I'm about to ruin it. Oh no. Hey, welcome to Star Cups. What can I get you today? Um, I'm here for my mobile order pickup. Sure thing. Name? Karen. Yep, it's right on the pickup lane to your right. Okay, thanks. Oh my God, I said thank you. It's not gonna, something's gonna be wrong. So, oh no, oh no. Something wrong, ma'am? Yes. I asked for a grande macchiato with almond milk, six pumps of syrup, java chips, six pumps of espresso, fresh non-dairy whipped cream, and double vegan fair trade chocolate sauce at exactly 95 degrees Fahrenheit. This is, oh Jesus. <laughs> Is it just the, it was cashew milk instead of almond milk? Can't you guys get a simple order right? Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. Let me remake your drink right away. Keeping his composure. 
This is a tougher victim of mine, but I will break him. I will break you and your smile. Sorry for the mix-up, ma'am. Please enjoy your fresh drink. No, that's not enough. I want a full refund as well. A refund? Yes, a refund. You've ruined my experience. That first sip is what this place is all about and you've betrayed it. Yes, we strive to get everyone's order right the first time. That's an important part of our business for sure. Your drink was exceptionally complex though. <gasps> How dare you? It doesn't matter what I ordered. It's not my fault you messed up. Whatever my order is, it's your job to get it right. I understand, but these things happen. We try our best, but nobody's perfect. You've got the drink you asked for. There's no need for a refund. You know what? <gasps> oh no. There's only one option. The Karen Trump card. I'd like to speak to the manager. Oh God, the music. What's it? Ma'am? He's the manager. No! <laughs> My one weakness. I am the manager. <laughs> He's a super villain. He is my arch nemesis. Look at everybody watching us. What? That's impossible. Oh no, they're filming us. They're filming us. I assure you, ma'am, I'm the manager at this location. I. Then I'll talk to corporate. Give me your full name and your employee number. I don't have to give you anything. Just like how I don't have to give you a refund. You should just leave. I'm not going anywhere. Oh no. I'll tell everyone online about this. I'm very prolific in several Facebook groups, you know. Ma'am, this is embarrassing. You're making a scene. <laughs> how dare you? Making a scene? Oh no, my fr- I just realized my freak out meter is all the way up. Uh oh, you're making a scene. This whole damn coffee shop is making a scene. Oh no, oh no, oh no, what am I? Ree! <laughs> oh no, I think I lost. Take this, you filthy communist. Oh, I threw my coffee at him. Oh, I assaulted him. Oh no, oh no. Uh, what the hell? Oh no, oh no. She's gone berserk. You think I'm the crazy one? Oh crap, oh no, oh no, I'm, oh no. That, that guy just ran to the bathroom. He's like, I'm no, give me that phone. Oh, oh, be, oh no. Insane Karen trashes star cups and gets arrested. Uh, I lost. Let's try something different this time. Fine print. Is there, is there fine print on the app? It says I'm entitled to a full refund. Yes, but that's only applicable if we can't fix your order. We've already done that. I understand your frustrations. Your drink was exceptionally complex though. It doesn't matter what I ordered. All right, let's go keep going after patience. Cause he's already confident, he's the manager. I bet you still can't remember it. Let me see, you asked for it. Oh God, he remembered it. He remembered it all. You know what? Oh no. Does that mean I lost again? I'd like to speak to the manager. I am the manager. Crap. All right, I'm still gonna try and take away his patience. I don't believe, take away his patience. Yes, yes, I wore him down, yes. You're the most ridiculous woman I've ever met. Fantastic. Hey, you shouldn't have messed with me. So long. Ugh, it's gone cold. <gasps> wow. After all that, oh my god. <laughs> oh, that guy hates me. I'm so happy though. I didn't even get my coffee. Ugh, this lady. All right, let's go to the food zone. Not wanting to let the day escape her, Karen saw fit to cross a vital task off her list. She would visit the grocery store and collect a few frozen pizzas to feed her family. Except she never considered. Uh oh. There were rules to be followed. <sighs> Not for Karen's. Excuse me, ma'am, ma'am. <laughs> what? Ma'am, didn't you see the signs? You can't come inside without your mask. Oh no. Oh, this is a recent one. My mask? Nobody is allowed in the shop without a proper mask. I didn't see the sign. How can I be expected to follow a rule you invented if your sign's not plain and obvious? Ma'am, the sign is very obvious. It's bright red with neon accents. So what? Crap, there's no green options. I still don't have one. I haven't got one on me or any at home, none. Zero. That may be the case, but the rules still stand. If you need to purchase one, we can sell you a pack of them for only $1. Now you're trying to force me to buy one? I'll just keep going with the green. They don't even work. They're worthless. You can pretend all you want, but I can't be fooled. Ma'am, this is on the advice of our health minister. I'm not a medical expert, but I'll follow the expert's advice. I recommend you do as well. Listen here, you. 
Oh, all bad words. I'm about to freak out. Ma'am! There's no excuse for that kind of language. Seriously, who hurt you? Who hurt you? Those words struck her. Suddenly, a repressed memory bubbled to the surface. Is this Karen's backstory? Come on, Karen, you can do this. Oh wait, this is her. <gasps> it's young Karen. I just gotta take the Smugson accounts, cross-reference these files, collate these documents by value, copy everything in triplicate, all before lunch. Karen! Yes, Mr. Boss Man? Where are those Smudson documents I asked for? The Smudson documents? They're almost ready. I'll have them to you very soon. That's not good enough, Karen. You're putting this company in jeopardy. I need them now. What do you have to say for yourself? Um, I'll, I'll try harder, Mr. Boss Man. I promise I'll do my best. So, you weren't already trying your hardest? Oh my god. He was a male Karen. Look at that chin, filled with arrogance. <laughs> he made her become what she is. This is like a supervillain backstory. I need this job, Mr. Boss Man. I don't know what I'd do without it. I don't care how desperate you are. I'm running a business, not a charity. M Mr. Boss Man, I... I... Please don't speak to me like this. You're being cruel. Oh no, he's freaking out. Listen here. Oh no. Oh, I'm running the business here. I'm in charge. You don't get to tell me anything. So long as you keep screwing up, I'll speak to you any way I please. You're nothing and a nobody. That's all you'll ever be. Do you understand? You're nothing. Oh my god. Oh my god! Ruined everything! Get it done! And clean these papers up! She wasn't born a Karen. She was made into a Karen. Oh god! It was the most hurt she'd ever been. The smallest she had ever felt that day. Karen vowed she would never let anyone make her feel like that again. She destroyed the sweet girl she used to be and hardened herself to the world. Never again would she take such abuse. Ma'am? Oh, I'm crying. I'm crying. Shut up! You don't know anything about me, so I'll tell you. I'm a mother, a loyal customer, and an active member of this community. I am close personal friends with the Deputy County Administrator. You think about that before you go any further. Ma'am, the country's administration set forth the guidelines. We're literally following those their suggestion. Please, it's better to be safe than sorry. Oh no, I freaked out! No! Re oh no, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? You can't control me! Oh crap, oh no, oh god. This is privilege! Oh no, oh no, oh god. Oh, I'm going to jail again. <laughs> Evil Karen refuses to wear a mask, kicks employee. <laughs> I didn't go to jail! Well, that's good. All right, let's try the spa. How could she possibly freak out at the spa? After a tiring day of getting her way, Karen needs a break. Between the demands of yelling at teens in the park and arguing about parking spaces, she needs to unwind. Karen needs a massage to work out all of the tension she's collected. As she approached the maxi relaxy spa, nothing could sour her mood. That's what you think. Or so she thought. Good afternoon, ma'am. Welcome to the maxi relaxy spa. Can I get your name for the appointment verification? Yeah, it's Karen. Just one minute, please hold. I see you in our appointments calendar. However, there's a minor issue. Issue? Yes, we're going to have to push your appointment back a few minutes. The group before you arrived a little later than expected. My apologies. That's unacceptable. I want to be seen now. I'm really very sorry. Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do. Oh, there they are. Just one moment. Hi, ladies. Are we all finished for today? Actually, no. Oh, no. It's my big day and I still don't feel relaxed. Tell your massage boy that we want another hour. Oh, um... There are other clients booked, but I'll see what I can do. Oh, you better not give them my appointment. I might be on Karen's side if you do that. That's messed up. Great, so can I go in now? Not necessarily. You see, it's that woman's wedding day and she's asking for a second massage. If it's okay with you. No. Oh my God, I'm turning into Karen. It's not okay with me. She wants to take my splot after making me wait. She's got another thing coming. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw down. What's the big deal? You're holding everyone up. And now you want to take my appointment? Oh my God. This old woman is totally losing it. <gasps> old woman? Drama? Oh God. Oh, what's happening? What? Is this my ultimate rival? Um, what's your problem? My problem? You ruined my appointment. And now you're trying to take my slot? Oh, I'm sorry. Not. Today's my big day. 
I don't have time to care about your problems. You wanna know what? You're selfish. You need to understand something. Nobody cares if you're getting married. Well, nobody cares about your opinion. You're just some dumb loudmouth who likes to be heard. Burn! Shut up. Who even are you? I'm loud, but you're dumb. Nah. You two need to relax and recognize what's going on. Look at the world. Oh, God. Who is this man? Look at our lives. We're all so overworked. Nobody has time for mistakes. The demand of our jobs, families, and communities. Social pressures demanding we be our best at all times. It compounds in a culture that lies, saying we can have it all. You both need to relax. Relax and realize that your enemy is not another person. It's capitalism to blame. I was about to say like, wow, is he gonna change them? No. Seriously? You don't even know what we're talking about. Yeah, we're nothing alike. I'm young, gorgeous, and I've got my whole life ahead of me. Meanwhile, this crone is just old and crabby. Listen here, you little tart. Your wedding isn't special, your marriage doesn't matter, your big day's a lie, your marriage won't last. Get him. Your marriage won't last. I can already tell. Knowing your type, you'll spend longer in wedding prep than actual marriage. Oh, that's an awful lot of projecting. Is everything okay at home? Oh, we're so close. We're neck and neck in tempers. Hun, you know nothing. Yeah, let's assume they got a prenup. The prenup says it all. You'll be alone and penniless in a few months, guaranteed. Yes, I won. Look at her temper. I don't have to listen to you. I'm going back in and there's nothing you can do about it. Oh, get her. Oh, get her. Don't you turn your back on me. You're not taking my appointment. Good luck stopping me when you're soaking wet. Oh, <gasps> yes. Yes. Wah, victory. My outfit, my hair. Wah. Ha, that's what you get when you mess with me. I'm going to get my massage. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I didn't realize I'm sitting there next to the Yoda man. Just watching her. She's just sitting in there. <laughs> Got him. I always get my way. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for Karen Outrage Simulator. There are so many of these Karen games. So if you like them, I will play more. If you want something else to watch in the meantime, make sure to check out some of these videos over here that are popping up. They're similar to this one. And if you made it this far, then you must have liked this one. So why not click one? Also, subscribe if you haven't. The button's over there somewhere. And so is the merch. Check that out. And as always, I will see you guys soon.